This is Patrick Vincent from Adamazi TV. Adamazi TV is a channel which aims at promoting African culture, showcasing African culture to the rest of the world, connecting African cultures back to its roots. So uh, we are here to broadcast our Mumwe Santi Yam Festival to the world today. So what do you have to tell us as uh, people in this very community? Yeah, uh, thank you very much, Adama, Adama uh, TV, uh, for this uh, opportunity and also uh, honoring our information, uh, invitation to come and uh, grace the uh, Santia Festival. It is, of course, the maiden uh, edition of this festival, happened to be 15th October 2022. You should know that Mumueres uh, 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 has uh, the number in terms of population in Taraba and also other Mao State and their major uh, uh, let me say uh, business or rather occupation is uh, farming. So and uh, we are known by the quality of our yam and we are also known by the quality and tenacity of our farmers to give the very best and the very best for whatever variety of yam that you are going to have on your table. It is no more news that uh, yam it is uh, in every home and definitely uh, we want to make sure that uh, the host community and other societies tend to enjoy from the endless labor and also commitment of uh, the Mumwe farmers. So um, today we are here to celebrate not only the Mumwe uh, citizens but rather to appreciate the effort of the farmers, the peasant farmers that goes uh, to, the, to the peak of the mountains and to the land and bread of fertile land of the Mumwe land to make sure that they cultivate and also make sure that there is food of uh, specific yam produce from Mumwe farmland to every table and household. And you know yam is a class of food that is what? It's starchy. And then definitely by the end you are going to get what? Carbohydrate of which you and I know that is an energy food uh, uh, class of food. So definitely what we are going to have is going to, to boost our energy and to make sure that we are up and, and doing in terms of activities, in our daily activities. So uh, today in, in the domain of uh, the chief uh, of Mumwe Nation, uh, Ado Adamumaza, we were able to see that we support him to celebrate all and sundry of Mumwe land. So besides even uh, family consumption, I believe yam is a cash crop and it has more economic importance. So as it stands, what are the, what are the benef benefits or what are the economic importance of yam per se? Uh, thank you very much. Uh, as you rightly highlighted, that yam is part, uh, is part and parcel of the cash crop. Especially for a common Mumere man, uh, he finds yam as the very best source of income uh, for livelihood. And definitely, uh, we will not, uh, for us to highlight the importance of yam in terms of economic value, it will be an understatement because the, 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 life, the livelihood of the Mumere man revolves around the production and the strength of your production of yam produce. So today, the Adomaza, the Mume chief, is trying to display and depict to the world that Mume men are the major contributors in the what? In the value chain of yam produce in Nigeria. So I want you to know that if you want to have the best yam, definitely you have to look for what they say, Er Jalimbo, as the local marketers will say. And this, by, by implication, they are saying that we should go for Mume yam. Thank you.